Fortum and the city of Stockholm are out on a mission. Whilst Europe is focusing on halving the greenhouse gas pollution by 2050, they are pushing it even further. In 2030, I think there will be um, a lot of electric cars in Stockholm. And um, uh, I think that we, we, have, we will be a modern city when it comes to transportation, to have a sustainable system for transportation. Fortum is involved in car projects and also other initiatives. Fortum is trying to turn the city into a more sustainable city by increasing the level of renewable fuels. We have been able to achieve a high level, over 80% of the production is now based on renewable fuels. We are providing charging infrastructure, those cars that are entering into Scandinavia needs to be charged in one way or another. So we are rolling out one phase charging, uh, charging units in public parking spaces so that people living in the city centre of Stockholm have access to charging. The objectives of the programme is to understand the impacts of the grid. We're a company that owns grids and we are selling and distributing electricity and also of course to understand uh, the extra power needed uh, for us as we are also a company producing electricity. During the Eurocities 2009 event held in Stockholm, the company offered to escort the delegates in electrical cars. Although they were on a tight schedule, the guests were offered to try out the vehicles for themselves. And did they enjoy it? Oh, very, very interesting, very good. It was really interesting to drive an electrical car. First of all, because it was so silent and it also gives you a good feeling that it's actually good for the environment. Step by step, they are getting closer to the goal. Fortum and the city of Stockholm are not only offering the city and its citizens a cleaner conscience, but a greener one too. The initiative is very interesting. Stockholm, their citizens and Fortum, they're doing something really, really brave here and I'm really looking forward to see what's coming up in the, in the next years.